Hey y'all, welcome back to the Fire and Water Cooking Channel. I am Darren. Today, we're gonna be cooking on the Heston Q for the first time. We're making crispy skin salmon on this precision cooking system. We're gonna see how it does. I'm gonna use the recipe from the app. I'll be right back. Smoking, grilling, getting hot and hotter. Sous vide and chilling from fire and water. All right, guys, just a quick explanation of what the Heston Q system is. It's actually a smart Bluetooth enabled induction burner that works with pans and pots from the Heston Q system that also have Bluetooth in it. And it works with your phone uh, with a uh, Wi Fi app that you can control the precise temperature of the pans while they're cooking. So it's very, very intuitive. The app itself has, I think, 600 uh, recipes built into it. You don't need to use those. You can actually control the times and temperatures manually if you want to, but it's a total, complete, smart cooking system where you can do sous vide and uh, precise temperature cooking in the pan. They also now have a probe that you can use with non-Heston Q pans that uh, measures the temperature of liquids or you can put it in the food as well. So check it out below guys. There's another link that'll show you more information on the Heston Q system. All right guys, I am back. And what I'm gonna do, uh, like I said, I'm gonna be using the Heston Q app with the Heston Q system. And they have several different recipes in here for salmon. They have a couple different ones for crispy skin salmon. Uh, I'm just gonna pick the simple one here and uh, I'll show you in the, the video uh, after I get this going how this uh, works in the app. Uh, but it's pretty simple. You choose uh, either two servings or four servings. The cookware that you're gonna be using, I'm gonna be using the uh, nonstick pan. It gives you the times and it gives you all the ingredients that you're gonna need. It tells you the uh, how many uh, tablespoons of heating oil, how many fillets, all that. It tells you the equipment you're gonna need. Most of that stuff I already know. When I use this system most of the time, I'm not gonna be using the recipe out of the app. Or if I am, I'm gonna just gonna be using it as a general um, rule of thumb. All right guys, I'm gonna show you the app here. So this is the recipe. You can choose the number of pieces, what pan you're cooking with. And you can scroll down, it has all your ingredients and actually all the steps are already there. You can look at them individually, but when you hit start cooking, it's gonna actually walk you through step by step on what to do. Um, tells you to take it out of the refrigerator, to get all your prep ready, measure the thickness of the food, uh, what doneness you're looking for, tells you when to add the oil, dry the salmon, season the salmon, Everything walks you through step by step. Everything is timed, all the steps that need to be timed are timed, and when it's done, it'll give you a ring and let you know. Uh, really very uh, easy to use and walks you through pretty much everything. You can't mess it up, guys, if you follow the instructions, truly. It's one of the easiest uh, programs that I've used, um, even with uh, like the Jewel, it's a lot more in depth videos with every step so it's really really good um, you can't you can't mess it up really measure your oil and putting in one tablespoon hit next step it's telling you to dry the salmon which I've already gone through that part next step choose your salt I'm gonna use salt pepper and garlic now this will tell you uh, it give you the different kinds of salt if you're using sea salt, diamond crystal, kosher salt, table salt, and all that. So I'm just going to tell it I'm using Morton kosher salt. It tells you to season it. So I'm going to go ahead, put this a little bit on both sides of the salmon. And this is, like I said, this is salt, pepper, garlic. Just enough. Okay, so we got it seasoned. Okay, so it's telling you the Q is preheating the cookware. And it's gonna actually measure it and tell you when it's ready to put the fish in. So right now, it's just measuring it out. It's heating it up. So once it's done, it's gonna tell you 
to put the uh, fish in. And it's telling you to add the salmon skin side down first. So that's why I had seasoned the skin side second. We're almost there. It's just over 400 degrees. All right, guys, our pan is ready. It's wanting me to, it's wanting me to add the salmon skin side down. So we're going to do that. And remember, I told it four pieces. So I'm going to try to fit all four pieces in here. I'm going to have just enough room. Get that in there. Just enough. Alright, and then I'm going to go ahead and let this go to the next step. And it says the cue is crisping the skin. And I'm going to go ahead and move these other two pieces out of the way. And it's going to give you times on the app for every step. You're just going to pretty much have uh, follow the steps. So we got another 25 seconds here. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and we'll be right back. All right, guys, we're down in the last uh, 30 or 40 seconds here. So I just wanted to let you know. So the good thing about this, this cooking system is you can be a pro or you can be a novice. And this is going to walk you through everything. If you're a pro, you can actually use it in manual mode. You don't need uh, your handheld. It'll work just fine. But this here, the recipes that are built in, we're going to walk you through everything you need to know to come out the perfect food. So right now, we're getting ready to flip this fish over. It's been cooking nine minutes on the skin side, and we're about ready to go. All right, now it'll give me a notification that we're ready to go. So we're gonna go ahead and flip the fish here. Make sure I don't mess it up. Ah, that skin looks so crispy. Oh yeah, this is going to be great. I'm trying not to uh, tear it up. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and flip it. We've got it all flipped. We're going to hit next step. Now it's going to tell you to add, if you were going to add garlic thyme or uh, any other seasonings. But you can go ahead and put just a little bit more oil in here. We're going to go ahead and do next steps. And it's telling you if you were going to baste it. You can base the top with uh, those seasonings, but we're going to get another six minutes on here at 372. So what's this doing the whole time it's cooking? It's adjusting the temperature. It's reading the, the temperature of the pan into the temperature of the uh, heating element of the induction burner, and it's all communicating with the app. So it's all trying to make sure that you got the correct temperature in the pan cooking the food at the same time. So we got another five minutes before this is done. Like I said, if you follow this recipe, it gives you instructions on how to baste it, if you have all the seasonings in there. We're just gonna go ahead, put a little bit more oil on. Not a ton. And I'll be back in five minutes, guys, when this is ready to go. All right, guys, we're down to the last 20 seconds here. And this is really crispy on the skin side. We're just waiting for this to finish up. And like I said, the, the really good thing about this system is it adjusts the, temp, adjusts the temperature for you in each cook cycle and it monitors it continuously with the pan itself, the uh, induction burner, and the app. So you always know what temperature the pan is and, and what it's cooking at. So, all right, now we're done. And it says take the uh, salmon out. And then you can cook another batch of salmon, is what it's giving me the option for. I'm going to show you that side. So that's the side we were just cooking on. And that is the crispy cook side. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off so it doesn't cook anymore. But I'm going to go ahead and take a bite of that to show you. That is a 
skin is coming right off so it's not soggy anymore. It's nice and crispy. Go ahead and take a bite of that. Mm -mm -mm. Perfect crispy skin salmon guys. Took perfectly medium just how I want it. Check out the Heston Q. I'm going to go ahead and fire up some more of these. And we're going to eat our dinner. But thanks for watching guys. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram. Make sure you check out the Heston Q cooking system at the link below. And I'll see you on the next fire and water cooking video.